Bonjour, Kinemagi and Nene Ireland and Dejnikas, and welcome back to Mystery Science Mystery One. Today's article brings us back to New Zella. Weather changes mean sea lion pups going hungry, washing ashore. The article is out of Santa Ana, California, located on North America's West Coast, Pacific Coast. Every June, sea lion mothers in California give birth to a pup. Then the mothers swim off for several days to find food. They return to give milk to their pups. The sea lion's favorite food are sardines and anchovies. These fishes have many calories and contain much nutrition. Early in 2015, these fishes were hard to find. Mother sea lions had to dive deeper and swim farther to find food. When they returned, they did not have much milk for their pups. Hungry pups were left stranded, alone, and starving when their mothers took too long to return. El Nino is a weather pattern in the Pacific Ocean. It raises the temperature of the water near California. El Nino is hitting California this year. El Nino can make it hard for sea lions to find food. Care centers gear up to help. Marine mammal care centers are preparing to help many stranded pups. The care centers feed the pups and put them back into the wild. Some ocean scientists warn that feeding the sea lions cannot fix the problem. The lack of fish in the ocean could last years. Jeff Shester works for an environmental group in California. We treat them as scared animals, said Shester. It is not realistic to save the sea lions, he said. If there is not enough food in the ocean, they cannot survive in the wild, he predicted. Most years, the Pacific Marine Mammal Center in California helps 110 sea lions. In 2015, the center rescued a record-setting 534 sea lions, and the center is preparing for even more this year. Keith Matassa is the director of the Mammal Center. That is a high number, but it shows there is something wrong out in the wild, said Matassa. Changes in the ecosystem. Mark Lowry is a scientist who studies sea lions. Every year for the last past 35 years, Lowry has figured out how many sea lions there are. For 35 years, the sea lion population grew. Historically, when El Nino happens, there are fewer sea lion pups. Three years ago, something changed. It was not an El Nino season, and births are very low. Something else was going on. The ecosystem changed, Lowry said. Those poor animals are having a really hard time right now. The sea lions were affected by global warming. It made it harder for sea lions to find food. Plankton are a group of various small sea animals. Anchovies and sardines eat the plankton. Plankton need nitrogen and sunlight. The right wind pattern can bring nitrogen from the deep ocean to the sun, sunny surface. This is called upwelling. Warm water disturbs feeding cycles. A warm patch of water near California known as the blob can stop upwelling. El Nino and other events can also stop upwelling. Without upwelling, the plankton cannot live. Without plankton to eat, the fish cannot live. Without fish to eat, sea lions go hungry. Hungry pups are stranded in California. Scientists agree that the sea lions are not even close to extinction. However, many more sea lions are stranded in California than usual. Usually sea lions are not stranded until spring. This year, they are stranded early. There are already stranded pups in January. Matassa has been hiring many more staff at the Mammal Care Center. We are not going to be able to save every sea lion, he says. Facts about sea lions. Weight, 700 pounds for males, 240 pounds for females. Length, 7.5 feet for males, 6 feet for females. Lifespan, 20 to 30 years. Diet, squid, anchovies, mackerel, rockfish, and sardines. Range, Pacific Coast, from central Mexico to British Columbia. Protected Marine Mammal Protection Act. We have now reached the conclusion of this reading. I would like for you to next click on the activities in the blue arrow, and then go ahead and take the quiz or answer the writing prompt. Writing prompt being, what search terms might you use to conduct 
more research to understand some of the topics in this article. Or you can choose to do the multiple choice quiz. When you are completed with that, return to the Google Classroom for further instructions. Mama P.